So then he goes, flashes back in time again to when he was dating Julia Roberts. He talks about their courtship. So then they're faxing back and forth. He sends her flowers. They start faxing every day. He has the entire writer's room of friends helping him write his faxes to Julia Roberts. He says she's like the funniest, best storyteller, and she was so quick. And he, he's like, I would be out at the bars talking to other girls, and I would leave mid-conversation to go see if I had a fax from Julia. And I'm like, yeah, I know. Let me, as a girl at the bar, I know that I do not hold a candle to primetime Julia Roberts. You don't have to sit here and like rub it in. We know. We all know that we're not Julia <laughs> Roberts. I'm aware. I've been told <laughs> every single fucking day i walk down the streets and a man comes up to me taps me on the shoulder and goes i'd say hi but i have to go home and check for effects from julia roberts and every fucking day i go home alone okay <laughs> so that could have been my lover if not for julia roberts's faxes 